Memphis Mafia Kid here with Mom and Dad, and we got some questions that were sent in, and we're going to try to get answered for you. So two, when? 2 a.m. in the morning. <laughs> we're just getting wound up. Just getting it's wound up. It's our time. Um, one of the questions is, did you guys ever visit the Circle G Ranch, and what about the ring that was lost there? So... Well, we lived we, on the we ranch. We lived on the Circle G yeah. Ranch. Uh, uh, when when Elvis bought it, he bought, bought, it. He, uh, bought us a house trailer. And, uh, one for first, himself. Uh, well, first, he, they were staying in the house, and he bought us a house trailer, and they had it, actually had it out by the uh, barn at the whole time because that was electricity. Mm. And, yes. Uh, we lived out there for a short period of time. Uh, then he decided he wanted uh, the other guys to be down there and and live on the ranch too. So he bought uh, I don't know several other trailers and seven seven or eight trailers had to have uh, all of them put in a certain spot, uh, slabs poured for them and all of that and. And uh, they were all on the uh, uh, south end of the uh, ranch property, mm -hmm. and there were several trailers, and the guys lived in them. Uh, our trailer was one of them, and uh, we had a. Uh, we loved a, it. It was we had, that was one of the best times that best, we had. Yeah, we Beautiful had a place. great time, and I guess uh, just. We had we had the horses. The horses, we, yeah, we had all the horses down there, and you know it was everybody just, uh, had everybody lake. had a horse and. And we rode and had cookouts and yep. just it when we'd come home from California, yeah, we'd come home from California. Everybody would stay on the ranch. Yeah, it was a great time. Had a had a big barbecue pit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he had that built and built. Uh, George Lewis uh, got that it. Melissa thought she got the brick. He actually from <laughs> <laughs> Melissa didn't. Melissa thought she got the brick from it. <laughs> And you know what we're That's talking about, Melissa. Melissa, you know what we're talking about. <laughs> uh, well, what about the the ring part? Uh, the well, ring. There was Elvis a big wedding. ring around it. No. Yeah. It was, uh, no. The the ring that we're talking about is uh, Elvis's wedding ring. Uh, we were all kind of that particular day racing. Racing the horses up, Races the up horses and down the up, fence. Up and on down the, the fence area. And 301 side, the Highway yeah. 301. Uh, and uh, Elvis had taken his wedding ring off because his scarf kept coming off that he wore and, and would have to stop and you know get it. And so he decided to put his wedding band over the scarf. And, and, and tighten it up. Yeah, and tighten it up and keep it, you know, like that. And uh, we got to racing again, and uh, it it stayed on a couple of times. Uh, but that one time, it, it uh, the ring come off and, and the scarf come off, and so we found the scarf. We never did, never find, did the find the ring. Never did find the ring. But you, but everybody was off oh. on their hands and knees down yeah, looking for and, it. Yeah, uh, and there was a lot of fans along the side of the fence there, and and. Uh, Elvis looked over and he said, "You know," he said, uh, "He said, I, don't we look like a bunch of idiots out here? You know, down on our hands and knees, scratching, <laughs> looking for something, and then all of a sudden he's what's going back, <laughs> back." He said, "Yes, yeah, me back, <laughs> looking for a ring back," <laughs> and, and the people could hear him. <laughs> and he said, "He said I think that's enough." <laughs> <laughs> See, I just have to get another wedding band. You can crawl, and then <laughs> get crazy. a little faster, and crawl back. <laughs> well, that was so funny, man. It was we, fun. we had a blast on the ranch. We did. We, we had did a lot, a lot of, of a lot of crazy beautiful things place. down there. It beautiful really place. Um, and, uh, we'll but that that's that's what the ring was all about. Yeah. The next question. But but he never found it. <laughs> no, no, never, never did find it. Okay, the next question is. Uh, was Elvis a member of the Knights Templar or Freemason? No, 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 no. He, uh, he, he had you, read. You talked about that because we, Billy was a Mason, uh, or is a Mason, and, and uh, uh, he was interested in it. He was interested in that and all kind of stuff yeah, like that. Anything uh, out of the ordinary or anything that was different, he was interested in. Right. Uh, yeah. 
Next question. Next, Next question. question is, and and it's and it says about the homemade bacon, but it was really about the ham. Back in the when they first moved to Graceland, they had pigs and all kind of Chickens animals, and, and ducks they did. And all kind of stuff um, they and had duck. the pigs. They had their own pigs slaughtered and made and had a smokehouse, mm -hmm. and they and, did the and hams and the and sausage and, and everything like. We always did out in the country, yeah. but uh, you tell tell about Vernon, and, Uncle Vernon but doing them. We uh, uh, he was going down to get a ham. Yeah, we uh, we were all uh, mm -hmm. up, and, uh, me and me and my brother Bobby was just kind of roaming around and and all, and uh, uh, saw Uncle Vernon. And he was uh, <laughs> going down to the smokehouse, and he got one of the cured hams, and he was bringing it up. To the house and all to be prepared for you know I don't know breakfast whatever but he got up there and there was a fenced-in dog yard which had uh, several dogs in it uh, I think it was like three or four little Scotties and and all that would he, they kept in that that dog pen and then they anyway poodles and yeah anyway uh uncle vernon came through the gate and all that close to the where the dog yard was and lord and behold bow here come bow tie <laughs> which was a turkey that it was solid white except for the two black feathers right there that his breast it looked like he had on a bow tie well now this this turkey <laughs> jumped everything it, was it a, had an jumped a turkey. Yeah, he was in a in a, an attack mode that morning. He had jumped everything around there, and he would flog the fool out of him. <laughs> so Uncle Vernon saw him coming, and he jumped to flog him. When he did, Uncle Vernon took the ham and he swung it at the turkey, and it slipped out of his hand. Yep, <laughs> right in the dog yard it went. <laughs> Needless to say, the dogs had a party for just had a few a, minutes. Had a great <laughs> breakfast. <laughs> they had a good breakfast, didn't they? <laughs> Oh man! <laughs> lunch was served, oh, lunch. but uh, they did get the ham out, and uh, I don't think they ate it. I don't, I I don't think so either. <laughs> it was just too much air. Just what you let the dogs have. It was a ham bone. Yeah, ham bone after ham that. Bone. <laughs> okay. Um, the next question is: Did Elvis ever threaten to spank Danny or Joey? No. Uh, they not probably, that I know they of. probably needed it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, he did. He did. Try to shoot us once or twice. No, <laughs> no just joking. No, he, ne he never did. No, <laughs> he uh, never did. I, I, you know, I don't even remember him ever. He never ever spanked seen Lisa. anything, you know, in, in any kind of way, correct in no, any kind of way, like that at no all. Harsh. Was, you know. No, he would have. Uh, Nothing he would hard. Have, he if just something didn't. bothered him, he would have said something to me. And, yeah. And, right. Yeah. But uh, Elvis didn't believe in. Uh, uh, Punishing somebody else's kids. No, which is not how he, he wouldn't have done. Hardly that. ever even corrected Lisa. You know, he just he just thought they were funny. Yeah, you know, whatever they he thought it was funny. He'd get on to her. She done something wrong, but but just simply raising his voice. But yeah, you know, <laughs> but that's as far as I go with that. Okay. Well, next. <laughs> the next question is: Have you ever attended any of Elvis's recording sessions? And yes. <laughs> yes, we have. Uh, oh God! <laughs> we went to Nashville with him I, to record, yeah. and and um, I only went there once or twice. And we were there when the trucks came out to Graceland, and we were up there while he recorded. And I know my first uh, first recording session with him was uh, 1958. Uh, he had gone up there to record to Nashville. To Nashville, yes, Studio B. We going up there to record uh, uh, some stuff to what they back then they call put in the can. That was to be uh, stored for later uh, use and put all. Put it in the can. Yeah, that <laughs> was you know can like uh, you can know can like can yeah, you know like vienas, you know. Yeah, you, no, four or five of them. Anyway, uh, I got a chance to meet uh, uh, a lot of the. Uh, Musicians at uh, that time, and uh, they uh, the Jordanaires had just hired a new bass singer, who was Ray Walker, and uh, he had a new get guitar player uh, at that time, uh, uh, Hank Schillif 
Hank Sugarfoot Garland. And uh, I know he'd, he'd uh, oh God, I've been quite a I, I just fixed to say, I bet that was a meeting. Yeah. It was Hank meet. Sugarfoot Garland yeah. and, and yeah. Billy well, Sports Smith. Well, that was his, you see, yeah. Yeah, his <laughs> Garland and Smith. Uh, well, uh, uh, too, um, um, uh, when did you meet Billy Swan? Billy came, uh, Billy Swan is a, everybody knows who oh, Billy yes, Swan uh, is. Was good, yeah. But, um, Billy is one really good friend of mine. Yes, we're, he's a we're great, gonna gr good friend of ours. Talk ours. about him later. Yeah. But, yeah. Uh, but he, 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 he wrote I Can Help and recorded it, and then later Elvis recorded it. Uh, that was Billy's song. Yes. Yeah. Did, did it. Right. Uh, and he also wrote Lover Please Lover by Please. Clyde McFadden, um, right, which was in uh, back in the 50s. Yeah. But anyway, uh, that that was my first recording uh, session. session with Elvis. And all I could do was sit in the chair and just kind of look up at <laughs> him. And I'd bring him water every now and then. And, uh, but uh, it was, I it remember was totally amazing to me. It really was. I remember we took him, uh, we, we weren't going to go with him um, on one recording session, and um, he was going to Nashville, and we took him to the airport, and he leaned down to hug me, and he said, uh, I'll see you in a couple of days. <laughs> and I thought, what? Because he, you know, and he said, I'll, be, I'll see you in a couple of days. Well, in a couple of days, he was back with a sore throat <laughs> because he he was he was not in the mood to record so he didn't record that time. But, uh, oh gosh, I was at so many different recording sessions. Yes, a lot of them. And it was fun. It, it was. It was, a, it was, it was always, very interesting always, and so. yeah, it was fun to watch. I I remember when they recorded at Graceland and and how how great it was when he did yes. you know. Uh, did that session there? Yeah, RCA, what, RCA was. They put up all these uh, look like quilts and stuff all yeah, over there. It, yeah, it, it, and they said because of the muffle carpet, the sound yeah, certain, yeah, they did it in the jungle room mm -hmm. because the jungle of, room. Uh, because yeah. of the carpet on the ceiling mm -hmm. that it. It's kind of soundproof. Yeah, like, it did the sound. Did it the, made yeah. the sound just right. So yeah. they uh, remember all the trucks being in the backyard. Yeah, and, yeah. Wires and stuff going through there. But that's, there. Um, yeah, that, that looks like, yeah, that's about the end of the questions. So we appreciate you sending in the questions and uh, hope you're enjoying the videos. Yep. And as always, remember, we, we always, always live Elvis. Elvis.